Hey everyone, my name is Brandon Levine and welcome to today's video. Today we're going to be learning how to use conditional logic uh, within AM forms to show or hide uh, different fields or an entire section of a form uh, based off user in input. So let's get started. So I already have um, a simple form created. I mean, that just has some a few different fields and the user input we're going to be capturing to show or hide these different sections is going to be this radio button and you know we could definitely use a something like a check box um, a text box you know whatever um, that captures user, user input uh, to show or hide these different fields um, so in order to get to our rules section i'm going to click on this radio button section i'm going to click on, click on this hammer and gavel icon and we're going to edit rules and then i'm going to click on create a new rule and now these work like your if uh, then statements you know if something is true then an action occurs so when radio button is equal to let's say choose one then we're going to have it show um, us this field and i can actually click on this icon to pull out all the uh, components on my form so i could actually physically drag over uh, maybe this, this particular text field and that's the entire rule so when i click done and close out um, so basically what should happen when i click choose one uh, this text box should appear um, but first i need to actually hide this object so it's going to be hidden when the form initially loads so when i go to preview and i click on choose one i'm going to click it's going to show it's going to appear so that tells us the rule is working um, although if i click on choose two um, this is still here um, because we haven't set a rule yet to actually hide the object uh, when choose one is not selected so we're going to go ahead and do that really quick and i'm just going to create an, another rule so maybe when i have it not equal to choose one then we can have it hide that text field click done close out and when we go to preview, I'm going to click on choose one, it appears. When we click on choose two, it disappears. And this can be done for uh, this entire section. So these three components are in a panel um, or are grouped together in a panel. So when I go back to my rules, um, I'm just going to go ahead and edit uh, this rule to uh, just have it show us this entire section. So how, we'll just drag out the section piece, and then we will just edit the second rule as well. And now when we go to preview, I click, oops, I forgot to hide the entire section. So let's go ahead and do that really quick. Hide object. And I actually need to unhide this appeared text box since we're we don't have a rule that's going to unhide it since our rule just unhides um, the section so now when i click on choose one the entire section appears i click on choose two the entire section disappears yeah so this video is just the purpose behind it was just to give you an idea on how to use the conditional logic functions within AM forms to do something like showing or hide uh, different fields or entire sections of a form to really enhance that user experience um, for the form fillers. So that's going to wrap it up for today, guys. I um, appreciate you guys uh, watching today's video. Please give it a like, please comment, and please subscribe. And have a nice day.